What's up, y'all? Welcome to my YouTube channel. This is your boy, Big Earlski. I'm gonna stop posting more. We're gonna start doing the ride arounds. Right now, I'm in the uh, box Chevy right now. I'm waiting for the uh, beauty for you to open up. Gotta get some stuff. Gotta get some head stuff. I'm just starting to uh, grow my braids out. So that's what we're doing. But today, it's about 15 degrees outside. I was gonna do a walk around, but it's too cold out there. It is not happening today. So, but I'm gonna stop posting more. We're gonna start doing updates on how we're gonna get the Chevy right. I got my center console and stuff. <clears throat> got my center console. I got the car system hooked up. Right now we listening to uh, GMO might go. How can we live? It sound it sound great. This sound great to show you, baby. It sound great. That's how we ride. That's what we doing. I'm gonna keep y'all updated on the cars, like with the uh, with the Camaro when I get it back from my bro house. It's been down there for a couple months, but. That's what we're gonna be doing. But I'ma get in here. Uh, I still got like 30 minutes until this store opened up. So I figured we just, man, we're just gonna do the walk around right now. Y'all know the Camaro is the uh, Optimus Prime thing. So I went on here and put them up in the uh, box Chevy. Riding, baby. I'ma get out this car and I'm about to see. We're gonna see. If I can withstand doing the walk around. The car been dirty. It's been parked for about a couple months. We've been having some issues at the at the house. So we getting that all straightened away, getting the house redone, renovated and stuff like that. But that's how we ride. Drink some water. You gotta drink that water, baby. That's cold that's been sitting out here all day. But I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start from the inside of the car. We're gonna start from the inside of the car. <laughs> I went with the center console, and I wanted to leave the old factory radio and stuff in there to keep it is with the original look. So I went with the center console to match the dash part. Uh, only thing is, I didn't bolt it. I didn't put no bolts in it, so it just wiggle around from time to time. So I try to keep the seat up on it, but I'm a bigger guy, so I gotta keep my seat back. So it tends to move, or when I kick it like that. But I'ma bolt it down. I'ma bolt it down soon. It got the uh, light display. It got uh, it got tweeters in the front. Uh, they are, I forget the size. I forgot what size tweezers they are. But they are, damn, I, I, forgot what, I forgot what it's called. But I went with the custom box. I got uh, my mom, death, more than a death date on the passenger side. And I got my dad's born and death date on the driver's side. Yeah, just, just to like keep them with me when I'm driving, stuff like that. You know, since they're not here, they're gonna ride with me. And this one, I'm gonna be driving for the most part of the summertime. But <clears throat> but in the spring into the summer, I want to get the uh, motor swap. I'm not sure we're gonna go five three or six zero. I'm not really too worried about power, so we probably just. I'm worried about power, but I'm just wanting something reliable. Like, probably just do cam, uh, E85 setup, intake, exhaust manifold, and then do a street tune and call it a day. Do some track, but I ain't really trying to get no big numbers. I'd want to use it as a daily or two. That's, that's where I'm at with it. But, and... March, I'm gonna start ordering 
all my stuff. Like I'm gonna order the digital dash setup. So I don't have to worry about the the original. If I do get up to 200, we ain't gotta worry about Max not at 120, yeah? That's how we gonna rock with that, baby. And I'm gonna keep it at that. We ain't gonna be doing too much tracking. We gonna be doing a lot of riding. This year into next year, we ready to go. I'm mad, <coughs> I'm mad a little bit because I shut the damn glove box and the damn lock fell out. So I just routed my USB cord over there because it was just sitting in the glove box anyway, not doing nothing. So I just said, shut it, stick it out the keyhole, put a tie wrap on it so the shit won't be flopping everywhere. But other than that, we good. Everything is pretty much all original. Like I said in the beginning, it's a little dirty, but we're going to throw My dog might go say I can use this song for the video, so that's what we're going to do. I'm going to leave a link in the bottom to the song, and that's how we rock it. This is a bro hand model. So it is the leather interior. I gotta get it cleaned up. Like I said, it's been sitting for a couple months. But other than that, it's pretty much all original. Uh, I do got a paint guy. We probably be doing paint in the summer, fall, into winter. Uh, we gotta get the. We gonna get the bumper filler. I'm gonna get all that, and then. The last thing I probably do is paint. So I ain't really too much worried about the paint and stuff right now. The hood is chipping because it was sitting in a garage, like under a under a garage shed. But other than that, she run pretty good. And this, uh, my girl did it. Link shut the door with her hip. Shut the door, didn't shut our way, and then she threw her hip into it and put a crease all the way down here, but this didn't, didn't pop out all the way. But that's nothing major. Like the door handle has snapped off. This one broke too when I pulled it. You know, when you when you heavy, you know, it's gonna happen. I do got a guy that do upholstery. He told me about six to $700 to redo the, the roof. Uh, I'm gonna take the, uh, Car to B and M tuning to get the uh, to get the uh, windows and stuff to get the old tent take up, taken off and cleared up so I can do retent. I probably go five percent with that. Uh, we do it's, it is running good. Like I said, it's 15 degrees out here. Flowmaster's got a little rumble to it. Yes, Lord. All right, do this. You see how my bumper is? Straight across, just like that. Someone ran into the back of me one night. Like, I was coming from the car show, and somebody ran right into the back of me on their phone, not paying attention. But that's it. Like I said, everything pretty much all original. Still got the fresh carpet on the door. I just need to clean it up a little bit. I just been riding around because I got to get the A and B and my other car is in uh, North Carolina right now. But I gotta get back in this car. It's cold as fuck. But other than that, the sailing liner and everything is good. In fact, it's one of the easiest ways for regular Americans to take advantage of this emerging industry. If you want to know how you can I gotta I wanna find somebody somebody know somebody that redo dashes like the cracks, the discoloration. Just tag it, put it in the comments, let me know. I definitely want to do all the weather stripping. So when I'm riding down the highway, I ain't hearing all the all the wind. I 
I did go with Android Audio. I figured try something different besides Pioneer and Kicker because everybody do Pioneer and Kicker. I figured I wanted to be different and go with an Android. <coughs> and I'm also uh, filming this YouTube video. This is going to be like one of the originals for me to stop blogging so i'm going to get all the kinks out but now i'm just i'm just going to start picking up the camera and start recording so i can get better and better every time but other than that i just gave you guys a quick walk around of the car get you a quick inside what i want to do so i figure i'm going to do do the ls motor swap not sure we're gonna go five three or six so not sure we can go aluminum block or or the heavier block i'm not sure yet so we're gonna figure that out when it's time to get there once we get there we're gonna get there we're gonna get it done once we do once we do the motor swap we're gonna do suspension and then we're gonna go big wheel and then we're going to the paint shop that's the order i'm trying to go in but if the order change up you know you can't everything not gonna go as planned certain stuff gonna happen but that's what we're doing and i also got a brother that he's doing a, he got the 96 he got the bubble the bubble crazy he just put the sunroof in there last he just put the sunroof in he got a little kinks to work out he got ordered a drive shaft and then it's in the paint shop and then he ready to roll so y'all gonna see us baby we coming tune in to the next video it's basically gonna be like a blog of my life i'm gonna start filming every day but later on the day i'm gonna tune back in and we're gonna be going to we're gonna be going to the shop i'm gonna show you where we hang out at where we do the ford and chevy talk we're just gonna be doing you're just gonna be following me you're gonna follow your boy big erlski hit the like and subscribe button Hit the share button, share it to your Facebook, share it to your grandma page, share it to your mama page, send it to your auntie, send it to your uncle, send it to your reverend, send it to everybody because y'all don't want to miss it. And then if they know about something, you don't want to be left out because you ain't subscribed or they ain't subscribed and they need to subscribe and you just not trying to send them the link. Don't be no hater, baby. Don't be no hater, baby. That's, don't be no hater. Don't be no hater. You know, everybody share the love. Peace and blessings. I'll be with y'all next time. Peace.